Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another Diecast Review. Today we got Chase Elliott's 2019. I'm going to go ahead and show you all the box. Chase Elliott's 2019 uh, Hooters Chevrolet Camaro. So we got Lionel racing down there. Uh, the official diecast of NASCAR. Chase Elliott up there. And then you got a rendering of the car right here. Uh, big old Hooters logo right there uh, with the standard finish thing. And then you got 2019 over here. Uh, and then you got the 2019 um, Action Racing Collectible stock car details. Um, never really looked at this, but uh, here's all the uh, special stuff that comes on it. And, uh, and then on this side, you got Chase Elliott, number nine, Hooters, 2019 Camaro ZL1, uh, one of 2029. So there's the box one more time. Go ahead and uh, get into the die cast. Very nice car. Um, I've gotten all the Hooters cars up to this year, so I thought, why not uh, grab the 2019 one? Uh, 2021 should be coming in a couple of days. Um, so yeah, we'll go ahead and take a look at this. Um, hood looks a little bit raised up, but that might just be me. My eyes playing tricks on me. Uh, looks fine. You got a beautiful sparkle type uh, glittery looking deal going on. Uh, you got Hooters there on the hood with the uh, Hooters out. I'm not sure if, um, if his actual paint scheme was like glittery, glitterly. I can't say that. It had glitter specks all over it there. We'll just say that. Um, but you got the Chevrolet nose right here, the ZL1. Uh, nine over there and um, little Hendrick logo there on the right down the left side um, again the sparkle stuff continues uh, I guess his real life car did have that uh, I'm assuming it did uh, I'm not gonna put a put a big error online now um, uh, when I don't know the, the true facts but you got NASCAR heat pro league right there uh, a little memorial looking logo up there I'm not exactly sure who that's for um nascar race car right there uh you got mountain dew and hooters going on the side with the big napa logo uh yeah and then you got kelly blue book up there pretty nice paint scheme uh i will say though his hooter schemes have been great through the years um since 2017 but this was probably my least favorite standard one but he ran um two two alternate schemes um along with this one he had the uh the breast cancer one and then the uh the um, spirits uh but we got a little mark going through the scents right there nothing really too too horrible uh hooters politically incorrect since 1983 if you can read this you must really love hooters <laughs> i do love me some hooters i do love their wings uh they're pretty good i think they're probably the best wings out there in my opinion but um going down the right side same old stuff you got hooters right there uh napa logo and um again a solid simplistic design uh between this one and the 2018 one it's kind of a toss-up i believe i like the 2018 a little bit more uh, when it comes down to it but like i said he made up for it with all of his alternate schemes that he ran this last year uh along with that uh, along with this one so i'll be sure to get my hands on those very soon um but yeah great car uh sadly didn't get victory lane so we didn't get a race version for it but hopefully Hopefully, Hooters can get victory land very soon. So, I'm um, looking forward to that. Uh, we got New Hampshire this weekend, so it should be a good race. Uh, looking forward to that. And then, uh, I think the next week, we got a Michigan doubleheader. So, um, a lot of racing coming up. But uh, that's going to do it for me. Thank you all for watching. Uh, reach out there and smash that like button and subscribe if you want to see more videos. I uh, really appreciate all the support. Thank you all for watching. Y'all have a great day, and I'll see you all in the next one.